And we're back. <laughs> and we're back. And we're back. Um, got Moscow here with me. How's everybody doing? Uh, we got Moscow from MoscowCollectibles.com. <laughs> um, again, I'm uh, Baby Huey from uh, WelcomeToFireside.com. So hopefully that's popping up down here at the bottom now. No? Yes? <laughs> All right. Um, Moscow and I are going to do something a little bit different here. We got a sports figure. Yeah, yeah. Let's uh, let's bring it out real quick. And um, this is the new Muhammad Ali from Storm Collectibles. Uh, I was really excited to get this because this is actually I sell a lot of things from this particular company, but I haven't actually opened any, messed around with any. So this is actually my first experience, hands on, with uh, something from Storm Collectibles. They make a lot of the uh, Street Fighter okay. uh, items, uh, Mortal Kombat. Uh, I know they make a Mike Tyson too, so they have a little bit of that going Ooh. on. Um, but this is, you know, fresh, fresh out of the case. So it's, it's, it's still wrapped in the. Uh... Yeah, they, they put a little <laughs> tissue paper on, which we're gonna. Rip that right off. We're gonna rip that off. We're gonna save this uh, for Mr. Mauer so he can wipe off. his tears when we open up something a little bit later. And uh, as we first look at the uh, the box here, we'll do a quick one. I know some people don't really care and want to see what's inside it, but this this box is actually pretty neat. Obviously, wide open on the front gives you a good idea of what's inside. And then, um, you know, some quality graphics around the... Yeah, from the side, it's just got the Ali logo and then the figure mm -hmm. himself, uh, followed by the Storm uh, Collectibles logo at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Now, the back of the box is pretty cool, because it's got a couple different shots of Muhammad, a couple of action yeah. poses and stuff. Mm -hmm. So, nice little... Uh, it's, a, it's a, you know, eye-pleasing box. I mean, there's not much yeah. going on to it. It's, it's plain and simple. Get right to the point. Yeah, uh, and that's it's pretty typical of the uh, the Storm Collectibles boxes. You know, big window, and then you know some just you know, graphics around the side. Uh, as you can see, though, it is the graphics of the figure, and not actually Muhammad Ali, which is which is interesting. Which I love when they do that. They actually put the actual figure. <laughs> this is pretty cool. Ages seventeen and up. Oh, really? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you saw that? I did. Uh, there you go. Uh, nice. Let's get this. Let's get this cracked open here. Here you go. We can easily get that cracked open with our good old machete. All right, you want to give that a give that a nice, nice little cut there. It is the yep. yep you saw it. There we oh go. God. Look at that. Awesome. Nice and simple. This marriage how these should be used. Yeah, yeah, not, yeah. not threatening while we're recording. Oh, so even inside the box you have some print, and that's hey, actually, the uh, Ali logo again in the yep. inside there. That's nice. Pretty cool. So this is in the the one twelve scale. Uh, I know Mr. Maurer had some questions about this when uh, I, I came by this this wonderful afternoon here, and now we're in the evening, so it doesn't show how long we've been here. <laughs> but it has the typical uh, tray design that a lot of these have, uh, kind of like Mezco. And this is nice. You got plastic cover on the top of it and behind the yeah, figure, behind so it's protecting it. everything. Yeah. That's really nice. Pretty, uh... Looks a little big for uh, 112. 112? Yeah. Do we have a uh, we have a ruler? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So already I'm seeing something uh, someone might have an issue with. Uh, we can get to that in a second. Uh oh. <laughs> now the in the neat thing about these, uh, they do have some cloth on here, but for the majority of it, uh, just popping glove, his hands off already. Glove came off. That's pretty cool. Um, so we have a cloth cloth uh, pants there. We do have a robe, which we'll show in a little bit. Out right now for you. Lost the head. Lost the head. <laughs> We're just gonna yank this right out of here. So we got a nice little Muhammad Ali uh, robe for him to. <laughs> yeah, you're pantsing him. I am pantsing him. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Uh, this is this feels like a like a bathroom actually. Honestly. Yeah, I, I read some things about it where um, he said it was kind of I don't know a little too the quality wasn't as. Uh, I mean, as, I feel that it's yeah, I mean it's it's 
nothing great um, in my opinion, but you know, you do have the print on the back, which is a nice touch. Look at that hammer I'll show that over here. Let's take a look. Between, oh, this head pops off. Head pops off pretty easily. A couple different. Uh, well, one of them's <laughs> one of them <laughs> is, a, is under right now. So took we'll take a dive. Right now, if we can get a nice shot on that there, a little little screaming head. <laughs> All right, there. And then also we got his. Go back to this camera here again. The normal, normal head here that came on it. Um, there's one more head, but it kind of fell underneath the refrigerator here. So I want oh to get that out after. Uh -oh. <laughs> but uh, let's get the uh, robe on here just to see how that looks on there. Sure. So it looks like too with, with the hands popping off, you can actually you take the hands off to, yeah. the, to make it easier to get the robe on. Which is a nice because touch. of this robe, it is no longer an action figure, and it is now a doll. <laughs> Just putting it out there. <laughs> Clothes make it a doll? Clothes make it a doll. Hmm. <laughs> oh, I think Mara might have something to say about that. I see why they complained about the, uh, the robe. It's a little... Uh, there yeah. we go. There we go. Yeah, it's a little, it's a little big. A little big. But, you know, it's still good. It looks like a yeah. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Muhammad Ali was a pin. That's right. He was the greatest. <laughs> now, the, the, the nice thing already, again, I, I don't have a ton of experience with this brand. Um, articulation is super smooth. So when I compare just, you know, the, the simple arm movement on this versus a uh, Mezco or Marvel Legends or, right. you know, some of the higher end... It's it's silky smooth. It's it's nice. Like even on the uh, the neck of turtles that we looked at last week, I had to finagle some of those joints to get them to start moving properly. Yeah, this I is mean, this is are, moving right nicely out of the box. Legs are a little little harder. I would pre move. I would prefer to legs be a little harder because it, it's holding the entire same. figure up. But your uh, your pivots are nice. Very nice. Um, if I do without the. Uh, Without the bathrobe? <laughs> yeah, let's 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 take the robe off. <laughs> let's derobe him. You know, just the kind of the texture on this and the feel. So if, if anybody out there has the Popeye, uh, you know, special edition, the white one, I mean that the quality on that fabric is is much much better than this. Um, even this doesn't feel like a bathrobe per se, uh, but it is you know it's again it's a nice touch. These aren't as expensive as um, some of the higher end, some of the Mezcos. Um, you're looking at about $65 for this. Uh, you might be able to find it for $60. Um, okay. But, you know, it's it's pretty cool. What I want to show, and, and we can go kind of go over this a little bit more, but the first thing that I saw out of the box, and we'll, we'll come over here. Let me know if you can get that in there. Uh, the paint on here, right by the boot, you're seeing some over... Uh, spatter or uh, overspray that's what i was looking for oh, okay um of the uh the skin uh, versus the boot so you can kind of see some of the brown <laughs> love it <laughs> that is crazy because it's right there and anyway um so right there you might be able to see that hopefully you can see that better than what you were saying <laughs> That that now will help you uh, adjust. Yeah. Uh, granted, it's on the back of the boot, but when I pulled it out, that was the first thing I noticed. If you kind of want to take a quick look, see how there's oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. that spray. His spray tan came on his boots. Yeah, I'm just kind of looking over to see if there's <laughs> any more of that. Um, yeah, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, I mean the boots look dirty. I'm is guessing. Your boot, is your boot rotation? There is uh, toe. Uh, well, I meant the actual like, toe the... flexion. Are we still over here? <laughs> I don't know the terms. They move. <laughs> Articulation is the least of my. Uh... Okay, so the, boot, the boots do move a little bit yes. here. So a little bit wiggly waggly, as I said last week. We, we, yes, you did. Yeah, say wiggly that. waggly. I think it's become my new term for this year. Is wiggly waggly. Um, I don't want to force it. It, it. it can do a full three sixty, but it is very tight. So I don't mm -hmm. want to force that anymore. But this is not a bad figure. And you said it was around what sixty dollars? You said about sixty sixty five. Um, yeah, we've got. I mean, m minus the uh, robe. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'd keep the robe off of it. Um, there are a couple other versions 
of um, of this particular figure. Uh, I'm trying to think of what they are. But I know, like the Mike Tyson one, there are a couple different. There's like the um, the heavyweight champion. There's the the one with from the Olympics. Uh, there are a few different, uh, you know, versions of that. So I want to say this is even the second version of this particular figure. Uh, you know, I, okay. I like it because you, you don't find many Muhammad Ali figures out there. So anytime no, you a don't. version it's comes out. something that, like up until like recently, you didn't really find much at all. Mm -hmm. So right. Muhammad Ali did not like licensing his, uh, what he looked like when he was alive. So his image and his thing, he would not license it. So after he's passed, um, just like all of the celebrities, mm -hmm. they become a little bit more lenient with it. That makes perfect sense. All right. Pretty cool. Can we get a detail of the shorts on the close cam? We sure can. In front of the lens. I'm ballparking it because it looks like it's in front of the lens <laughs> it, over it, here. In my angle, it looks like it's in front yeah. of the lens too. A little closer to it. <laughs> this is booty. In his booty. So let's see the side. I mean, those trunks, the stitching, what what sells a 112 figure is the small details. And if you spin it to the front, the Everlast and the waistband mm -hmm. look good. Mm -hmm. Much yeah, better look, than the robe. It looks like real trunks. I, I really like that. Mm -hmm. But remember, it's a doll. <laughs> Mos Moscow said... It is a doll. <laughs> Once you put clothes on it. <laughs> That's funny. Or if it's Amigo. Amigos are dolls. <laughs> they are dolls. They are dolls. They are literally dolls. dolls. All right. Cool. I like it. I mean, I'd like it too. I'm sold on this. I mean, so if, if you're definitely into uh, collecting sport figures, and seriously, you can uh, pick them up. And where can we get uh, something like You this? can get this at moshcocollectibles.com. I'll just leave it like that. <laughs> um, all right. So um, we'll be back in a few minutes. Uh, I'll be back here with uh, Mos uh, I'm sorry, with Mr. Mauer. Uh, we're going to be reviewing the DC bombshells. All right. Um, and before we get going here, uh, make sure you guys check us out on uh, Facebook. Uh, welcome to Fireside. Make sure you also check us out on Instagram. At welcome to Fireside. Toying Fire. around. Toying around. When do you talk? Right. <laughs> and then also on uh, Twitter at Toying toy around. around. No G. It's too long for G's. <laughs> no Although G. we got plenty of G's right here. Uh, wow. <laughs> wow. Hey, you know, you got to try new things here and there. And make sure you also check us out at the OG Podcast Network. See, that's where I was going. It just I, didn't come together as smoothly as planned. You're trying to G for the OG. I got gotcha. you. Uh, right. For next time. <laughs> uh, so make sure you check us out the OG Podcast Network. That's OGPodcastNetwork.com. Or the app. <laughs> the, the app. <laughs> Gotta get the P to pop. And you can also find it uh, YouTube. Uh, on, uh, what's, the, what's the tag there? Guess what? Toying around. You can find us there everywhere, all uh, social media with uh, toying around, except for Twitter. Leave out the G. The G is for OG, and that's what we're going with. I like it. We'll figure something out with that. <laughs> cool. We'll be back soon. We'll be right back. <laughs>